Absolutely. Dean, how pleased are you with that? Yeah, very pleased. Obviously, uh, we asked for a reaction from the weekend, and um, obviously the guy tonight. That was that's a, it's a hard place to come. There's not many teams that can come in and get three points. Um, I think that's a, only the fourth time they've lost here in three years. So I was told before the game. So obviously, well, obviously three times before the game. So obviously, to a man in there, that changed it in Lazarus Sandin. Yeah, and you had to really show some grit and determination. Didn't yeah, you? as I, as I said, <clears throat> it wasn't pretty, but it was full of everything that that the fans want to see: the passion, the desire. Heading the two centre midfielders were outstanding, covered every blade of grass, competing for every second ball. Every, everybody put a shift into it. Manny Smith is a big character in every way, isn't he? Yeah, he's, a, he's, a, he's laid back, he's very quiet, uh, he's not the mo most vocal in the change room, but he, he leads by example, and he, he leads by example on the pitch. As I said, um, the two centre halves, they were giants there. They, they got a big lad up front, they hit a lot of diagonal balls onto on them for them too, with the winning headers, but again, it's up the pitch about 30 yards and the winning proper headers. Manny has been telling us he's never scored two goals in a game. Can you believe that? He's probably never scored two goals in his whole career, has he, or <laughs> in a season? No, as I said, look, we're not bothered who scores, but you know what? He's We've told him to get the balls in the right areas. His body's in there, and obviously, Manny, luckily enough, Manny was there tonight, and all being well, it could be somebody else at the weekend. On a scale of 1 to 10, how annoyed were you when they were got to go back within a minute of you scoring? Yeah, obviously, we're disappointed. You can look back. Uh, there's one or two things that could have done a bit better in the lead up to their goal. Uh, them lads will learn from it. Um, but then you look at it, you've got bodies flying in everywhere. And um, I think it's Sandwich, which has got an unbelievable block on their first one. And it's gone to, gone to somebody, and he's just poked it in. And then obviously, second half, Manny brings one down on the edge. Plays back to Scott Bolden. Um, great strike on the half volley. It's on target. There he gets a block on him. He flies out for a goal, for a throw in, and you're like, oh. Where's our little bit of luck? But no, the lads kept going in the end. They kept going, and I'm really proud of them. So, how important was it after Saturday to get our off and running tonight? Yeah, look, we were disappointed at the weekend. It was a great turnout. There's a lot of optimism around the place, and um, obviously, it's a new, it's a, it's a new squad. It's going to take time to gel. They know each other. They've all crossed paths at, at other clubs, on to twos and threes. But obviously, it's a new environment. It's a new, it's a new, new football club. There's a big expectation here, obviously, to come at the weekend, over 6,000 fans, um, you know, over 350 tonight, that, that's Friday, and uh, to come all the way down here on a Tuesday night, I'm, um, I'm pleased that the lads have all sent them all happy. And in good shape for Dover now on Saturday? Yeah, yeah definitely, um, obviously, got Chris Allroyd, he's going to be out for a few weeks, um, I'm hopeful that we can get something in before the weekend, but um, as I said, the, uh, the lads will be proud of themselves tonight and the performance they put on the pitch for the Has the this bought you any time, but you still hope to get somebody in, how close are you? <laughs> We're not close as I want to be, if I'm honest. We've got options, I've got options if we want to go and do a loan. I'd like to do a permanent. It might take a few more days, if I'm honest, but obviously it's a case of, I need to have a think about whether it's, it's definitely going to happen. I'm not 100% sure it's definitely going to happen anyway, so it might be possible to might go the long route. But it's better to be in that position with a win under your belt, isn't it? Yeah, look, we asked for a reaction from the weekend, and as I said, it wasn't pretty. They played in the right times and the right areas. It's, it's a difficult place. I'm honest, the pitching amazing. But it is what it is, and uh, you know what? As I said, I don't think many teams will come here and take, take three points on. Well, then, Cheers, thanks a lot. Cheers to you.